is Erica, and today I'm going to show you how to ball up the ends of copper uh, with a kitchen torch. So I have a um, soldering block, and then I also have this. It's one of my old ones that goes on the, the tripod thing. Uh, what it does is it provides air uh, to go underneath your, your piece. So I'm going to use some flux. Uh, this also is a protectant. Um, you're going to need a pickle pot as well uh, and a steel wire brush because once you're done, you need to pickle it uh, to get the fire scale off. So I'm just going to use a normal kitchen torch. Let me scoot this back before I start. Now you want to go the complete length of your piece and just heat it up until it's like red hot. If you keep trying to heat one end, um, it's not going to work because this entire piece has got to be hot or the flame's going to keep trying to heat this part, you know, and, and instead of being focused on one end. Okay. I may have to put it up on my tripod. That was an epic fail. So take two. Oh, we have copper ball. <laughs> but um, I'm going to go put it in some pickle. So once it starts melting, uh, if you want your copper ball on the end to be bigger, then you need to move your torch immediately up, up your piece. Because if you don't, then you're not going to get a successful rolled up end. Uh, it's really important for me to be able to use it on a tripod for some reason with copper. Um, copper is a lot different, a lot more different than silver because it, it takes a lot more to melt it. So I'm going to go and pickle this and then I'll be back and show you. So successfully balled up copper, right? Um, I used two different kinds of flux aqua flux and uh ruddy flux because I, I don't know why but it just helps somehow but it does um anyways 
um, it helps with the, the kitchen torch. This thing reaches 2,500 degrees. It is not a sponsored product. It's just one that I've used for the past year. And it works really good. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoy this. Um, and I hope it helps a few of you guys that have been wondering about this. Have a good evening. Thank you.